Yeah, it felt good. I thought I got my first goal against um, Real Betis. Um, and obviously, the cameras didn't show that. So um, it was a bit of a scruffy finish today, but it was the same sort of thing, just following in. And um, yeah, I think I kicked it, he saved it, and it's hit me again. So it's got it's a bit lucky in the end, but I'll definitely take it. It was a good feeling. Yeah. I mean, just in terms of you've been out for such a long time since the same back in the day, yeah, no, it does feel good. Um, it's been a long time being injured, and um, I was nearly back, and then I got a concussion in training, which then put me back another few weeks. Um, so it's been frustrating since then. Um, but the the lads and the the manager have been great, just make me feel still part of it, and um, yeah, wanted and needed, and. In, They've always said all along that you you'll be needed before the end of the season. So, I mean, how does, as a patient, who are you sort of watching the team first, sort of doing well, and then just starting those slump ups that are being a thing? Well, and you sit in the sand, how do you think you usually sort of cope with that when you're not able to play a part? Um, well, that's the thing. You you can't do anything really. You know, you the lads ask me what what they think when we get back on the bus and stuff like that. What I think, um, and I'll just be honest with them about what what I saw and. Um, yeah, you can't really obviously affect it too much. Just be around, stick at it, and then keep working hard. So if you, if you have anything, you're coming back at the business end of the season, you know, four games come up, and you know, really look forward to the end. Yeah, I think that today um, the the 45 minutes was a good um, amount of minutes. It's probably a bit more than that in the end, um, but to get get that match fitness back. Um, and then, if I'm needed from from now on in, then hopefully that'll stand me in good stead. Yeah, I'd, I'd be ready um, to start start games now. Um, like I said, I think that 45 minutes um, has has been a good uh, building block. Um, and yeah, it's just funny how it can it can change just being battling to be in the squads and things like that to um, getting on today and and um, contributing so no it feels good today how, how are you guys feeling about next week's game Ben? feeling good um, you know we've, we've scored four good goals today we've we've created lots of chances today obviously it's going to be tough tough task to go to go and win but we're going to go and try and win and and um, see how we go from there do you feel that if you do win Ben it could be the start of a, a special month for the club um, well, there's opportunities for, for two trophies um, between now and the end of the season, so the next game's always the most important, and now that's that game, so um, obviously that's the that's the important one now that we're all going to focus on. What happened with your concussion? What um, so it was, we were doing, I think it was a Thursday before a Saturday game, so we were doing like some shape, or attack v defence, and I was in the opposition team, um, and the ball's I think it's bounced off the crossbar, gone into the floor. I've jumped up to flick it, and then one of the players, I won't name who, <laughs> has gone to try and score a goal, and I've just nicked it, and then he just got me on the back of the head, but I had a headache for 10, 12 days after that, which was a bit bit concerning, but it's fully gone now. I mean, just, I mean does, that, does that feel like the way your luck was going at that point? You know, you're just back from an injury, you're ready to get back from the team. Yeah, you know, well, I was just starting to feel good in terms of um, training, like fitness and feeling a bit sharper. Um, so it was frustrating, um, but like I say, you've just got to stick at it. And you know, I've been—I'm not young. I've been around the, the game for a while. It's you never quite, you never down and out. You know, you've got to stay focused, and then because you never know how it can change so quickly. Well, next week's game, you're going to have to sort of keep clear heads on you. Know, it's sort of a especially when all base support there, yeah, 100%. We need to play our game. Um, we need to be good on the ball. We need to be aggressive, and we need to attack um, and defend well. So we need to play a good game to to win that. Well, there was a lot going on first half, wasn't there? It was very, um, you know, there was VARs and 
penalties and red cards and there was all sorts going on. It was I've never actually seen the first half quite like it, to be honest, um, from the bench. But I, I thought that we stuck at it well and then um, obviously them going down to 10 men probably gave us more space sec second half um, and I thought we exploited it well and we created lots of chances.